What's up, everybody? Welcome back to a brand new Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links video. In today's Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links video, we're going to be continuing our Welcome to the Duel Academy Let's Play. We are on episode 2. If you guys missed out on episode 1, I'll throw that in the description down below so you guys won't miss out on that. So be sure to go check that out. Uh, first, we got an epic Elemental Hero OTK that happened in that episode. It was a ton of fun. And yeah, in today's episode, we're going to be uh, battling against Alexis and Chan. So if you guys are excited for today's episode, be sure to go hit that like button down below. But of course, you can wait to like the video until you actually watch the full thing. Now, I did not change my deck um, at all from the last part i'm actually recording this episode right after i uploaded my um first part um to the series so we're still rocking this deck i don't think i'm going to make any changes to it for now because i don't even think jaden changed his deck much um when it comes to this part that we're in in the uh, event anyways so we're gonna be keeping it with this for now and hopefully things go smoothly like it did the first episode but now that i said that I probably jinx myself so we're gonna knock on that wood sorry if i spooked anybody thinking that someone was knocking on their door uh, but yeah, let's just get going on today's little event. Let's go roll some dice. Hopefully we can get through this event with only 41 dice. Hopefully we can. I think we might be able to, but I've completely forgot that you need dice to get through this. Now, I'm just going to auto-duel Vagabond. I don't think I'm going to win against this one, nor do I really care about the AXP. So we're just going to auto-duel through this one and everything like that, and hopefully get to the, uh, going against Alexis, everything like that real quick. But yeah, we out here. Getting these sick hands. Oh, look at this beautiful hand of literally just monsters only. Um, actually, I think I want to make one change to the deck. I think I want to add Vision Hero, um, the, the Vision Hero, not Vylon. What was it? Vision Hero Trinity? I think I want to add that uh, card real quick. So, I mean, look at this hand right here. This would be a perfect opportunity to go against that right there. But as you guys can see, look at these big brain plays from the auto duel going for that direct attack. I don't think it's going to matter, though. I think it's going to be a, a recipe for disaster. It really is going to be a recipe for Daster. Going in for our second Poly. Maybe I should run three copies of Polymer Station instead of Fusion Sage, to be honest. Um, but yeah, this is not its not going to work out for us. It's really not. I, I don't really have any confidence in this duel. Oh, yeah, you can go for the big boy. And that makes sense. Makes a lot of sense right there. But yeah, I don't think we're going to win this one. We're going to get Uthra right here. Vagabond is just a big bully. Just a big old bully. That's all I can say. Just a big old bully. Yo, Skyscraper, though. Let's go, Wall Disruption. Okay. It's like, I can't handle this meta. This meta deck's too powerful for me. God, we got oof. I don't feel sorry for GG and got decimated. That's not good. Vagabond absolutely destroyed us. Good thing we don't need to win against Vagabond in order to, you know, go on. So that's good. That's good right there. I will, though, let's change up the deck a tad bit, though. Let's actually do some on-screen edits. So we're going to add a third poly. Remove that, and then we're gonna remove that. You know what? We're gonna have a secret trick on a secret trick up his sleeve. Uh, where is Trinity? Trinity, where are you at? Now, I don't think we're gonna summon into Trinity, and that's kind of why I'm throwing it in the deck, um, anyways. But the Trinity is gonna be our secret weapon, it's gonna be my power given to Jaden so that we can get these victory royales. So, let's get this bread. We got a one, so we're gonna go through the story a segment. Let's go. The day will come. Duel Academy has a lighthouse to guide ships to the island. Alexis and Zane occasionally meet there to talk privately in order to solve a mystery. Oh snap, it's Alexis. Learn anything? No. Nothing today, just like yesterday and the day before. My brother is still missing. Give it time, we'll find Octus no matter what. Thanks, Zane. I don't know how long it'll take though. Yeah. But the day will come. I know it will. Very cool, I got 50 Millennium Coins like that. So this is a completely side thing, um, and everything like that. We're gonna continue on through our adventure. Hopefully we can get through this whole event with uh, the dice stuff. Or if we don't, then I guess we're gonna do a little bit of auto-dueling in this episode. So that's like crazy. Going against Alexis though, and I gotta say, the chibi Alexis in this game board is really cute. I like it a lot. Hi, Jaden. So what exactly is going on here? Well, uh, to make a long story short, I'm a big loser. Your friend trespassed into the girl's campus. Is that true, Sai? It's not like that. And now that you're here, Jaden, you're trespassing too. That's right, so if you don't want us to turn you in, you're gonna have to win your freedom by beating me in a duel. So if you turn us in, we'll be expelled. I'm sure someone used my name to trick Jaden into getting into trouble, but Cyrus got caught in the mess instead. It was the perfect chance to get Jaden to show how good he really is. Don't worry, Sai, I won't get us expelled. Let's duel, Alexis. Yo, we're gonna get this easy victory royale. Still try to get Pot of Greed though, so we're gonna activate the items thing because we're going to try to get that Pot of Greed. And I think, don't we have, don't we have Thunder Giant in our deck? I think we do. Let me go check. But I, I believe we do. Where, where is my boy Jaden at? 
Uh, yeah, we do. Yo, we got this iconic deck ready to go. Let's go. So let's just do this just epic duel. Let's get some epic duels in today's episode. Alexis versus Jaden. Let's see if this on um, this thing though. Ooh, I like it. Dude, this whoa, you can even see the little dorm over there too. That's awesome. Yo, they did a killer job with this event. I'm not gonna lie. Like this event's honestly so cool. What does Victory on Ice do? Hmm. No down in ages. I mean this is the first time we I this is the this is the first time you're dueling Alexis. No. You're, br you're breaking the immersion. This is not okay. This is Mirror Forest, we need wrong card. Okay, wrong card. So I think we can go. No, we cannot. But we still have a chance to. So what we're gonna do, we're going to set Clayman and set our mirror force and call it a turn. Okay, dude, we're gonna get this anime duel going, but like, come on, I need that pot of greed. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Are we going are you already summoning your big girl? You are, relax. Well, we're gonna check out the sick animation. I do like this animation. There you go. Cyber Blader, show the crowd. Yo, relax, Alexis, though. Yo, but look at this epic, epic duels that we got right here, boys. Look at that. Very cool. Well, good thing we have a handy dandy. <laughs> good thing we have a handy dandy uh, mirror force on our side. Oh, we're decimating everything. We're decimating everything. Cyber Blader got. Wait, what does this thing do? While well, your opponent controls one monster, can't be destroyed by battle. Okay, so. Yeah, so I think we should be able to use Mirror Force. Here's goes nothing. Oh, I was hoping he had a voice line for Mirror Force, but he doesn't. You know, like oh, we just need Pot of Greed though. That's what we need. We need the Pot of Greed meme. Here I go. My turn. Avion. Okay. Well. Wait. What do we? Don't we have an Avion? Okay. Uh, but we don't have Thunder Giant though. That's kind of that's kind of lame, honestly. Well, for now, let's go into Polymization. And let's go for a super sick fusion. Oh, we could go into Trinity if we want, but probably not the thing to go for. And this elemental here are kind of trash. This elemental here are kind of trash, if I'm going to be honest. I mean, good thing we got Skyscraper. Skyscraper's going to help out. That would be nice. But let's get that 1900 damage going. This is literally an anime duel. Literally the anime duel. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? Dude, I am ready. You draw. Cyber Jimis, can you attack directly? Forget what you can do. Oh wait! Whoa! You just killed my monster. That's not cool. That's not cool at all. You just, you just decimated my monster. What a bully! Why is Alexis bullying me? What did I do? What did I do? Alexis just took out my wild wingman. What a jerk! And yeah, you better set that monster. Let's go. We got Captain Gold. One of my favorites. Oh, I thought he had a voice line for this. Like, dude, James memeing on me, my guys. He's memeing on me. But let's get this victory royale. We didn't summon Thunder Giant. Probably should have waited, though, and summoned Thunder Giant for, the, you know, the nostalgic and for the canon of the show. But, no, I want to hear Alexis screaming like she just got killed or something or about to get killed. Because that's literally what that sounded like. That was kind of spooky. I'm not going to lie. Did we murder Alexis, guys? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Still drinking the same Mountain Dew from last episode. <laughs> but yeah, we got through all that, so that's cool. What can you do with only 200 life points left? Due to Fusion Gate's effect, I summon Elemental Hero Thunder Giants. Hate to break it to you, but my Cyber Blader's attacks are still higher at 3600. But Th Thunder Giant can destroy any monster whose original attack is less than its own. Original attack? That's right, attack without any kind of enhancement. Thunder Giant automatically destroys your butt Cyber Blader. Buster Blader Omega Lol, that's what I was about to say. And I still have this attack left to use on you. Voltic Thunder! Ah! A plus voice acting from your boy Wad007. Well, a deal's a deal. I won, so we get off free. Okay, guys, as we agreed, I won't back out. You beat me fair and square, and that's all there, to, there is to it. Can't freaking read. Nah, there's more to it than that. You sure played a close match, huh? You got game. Later. Even if I did win, I could have never turned those two in. Nice. Welp. Uh-oh. Lucky brat. He escaped this time, but I'll find a way to expel him. I forgot about that. Crowler was the one that set up this whole scheme as it is. I forgot. I forgot right there. Oh, we have a scene album? Oh. Oh, cool. 
That's a cool little feature. That's actually a pretty nice feature that they added. I, maybe this was in a previous event, but I couldn't be mistaken. Anyways, though, we got a three, and looks like we're probably gonna need an auto duel. We're probably gonna need an auto duel against her, and we're probably gonna need an auto duel just a little bit to get some more dice fragments in order to uh, defeat the Chaz, that Chaz guy. So let's auto duel against Emma real quick. Um, and have a good time with that. Look at that broken deck Emma got. Like, stop flexing on us, Emma. Just stop it. Um, so we're gonna go for that. Boom, bada, bang. We got Percinatrix that we're not gonna use. But we should get this Victory Royale. So that's cool. I do wanna check, do I have any of these, like, little dice things that I can automatically get a roll for something? Do I? Let's find out. Um, so support items. Oh, I do. Cool. So, we can, I guess, we can do this, I guess. Get the coins, and then use our other support item to go three spaces. So, let's use that instead. Cool. And now we're going against Chaz. It's time for your monthly field test. You will duel against an opponent in your own dorm. Except you, Jaden. You'll duel against Chaz. <laughs> I'm dueling an obelisk, and it's Chaz? Let's you always talk big game. I pulled some strings to get you the challenge you deserve. So congratulations, you'll be dueling one of the top-ranked students in the school. And if you win, you'll be promoted to raw yellow. What's wrong? You aren't gonna thank me? Okay, I'll get my game on, and I'll finish what we started at the obelisk arena. Indeed, in front of the whole school there, everybody can watch. No excuses this time, Chaz. Bring it, Slifer Slacker. Okay, boys, this is gonna be an epic duel. Of course, we're gonna use uh, one of the little bonus things so we can get that pot of greed, because someday I'll get pot of greed. And oh, we should have built the Wing Karibo deck. I actually have a copy of the Wing Karibo. We should have done that. Those are the challenges for this. SMH. Actually, I should probably throw one copy of Wing Karibo in the deck for the anime and nostalgic stuff. It is what it is, I guess. Okay, not that bad of a hand. Not bad of a hand. So, can we? Did we get Pot of Greed? I don't- I need Pot of Greed! Give it to me! Anyway, so Sparkman and Avian, I don't think that's a combo. Yeah, it's not. Um, so what we're gonna do, though, we're gonna thin our deck. We're gonna summon our Vision Hero Vylon. We're gonna go for that, and we're gonna activate its effect. And we are going to... I guess we could sack off. I guess an Avian. I guess I'd rather sack that off. We want- we don't want to- I was gonna do Brisinatrix, but I don't want to do that anymore. But we're gonna do that, we're gonna banish that, and add that Prismatic Polarmization. Next up, we're just gonna- I guess we could just end turn right here. Yeah. We'll pass turn right here. So we got Skyscraper, which is good. We can use Skyscraper if we need to. X-Head Cannon, that's gonna be something to get over. And Frontline Base, this is gonna be annoying to deal with. Yeah, it's not good. Not good at all. Uh, I'll probably use my Regeki just so this guy cannot have so much board advantage. And hopefully we can draw into a card. There we go. That's what we needed to. Okay. So what we can do... Does this search? Uh, destroy my battle card effect. Destroy this card if, um So I think we can Regeki. I think Regeki will be good enough. Boom. Okay, yeah. You can search for something, which is annoying. Uh, but we should be able to get really close to OT Kang. So let's activate that Poly. And then let's go into our Flare Wingman. Elemental Hero Flame Wingman. I keep calling it Flare for some reason. Oh wait, oh, I was about to say, don't skip the don't skip the animation. Dude, look at how clean this animation is. Look at this beast. Oh, we should have played Skyscraper right away too. We should have played Skyscraper right away too. Um, but this guy's very epic. And we're gonna summon our Sparkman. And while we're at it, let's summon uh, Skyscraper. Look at this epic. Look at this epicness. Flame Wingman. Boom. And then we're going to go for that elemental hero, Sparkado Man. Hopefully we're good, because Chaz can turn this around, because Chaz, Chaz has more card advantage. I'm pro I probably am making you angry. Okay, so he's going to go for that right away. Go for the wing catapult. Throws it to defense position. Okay, are you going to go for it? Yep, you are going to go for that. Now, do, do you have an effect that destroys me? Thank goodness you don't. That's a very good thing that you don't have. But we do have a problem that I just realized. We have a big problem. And you want to hear what I'm mad about too? We literally have the option. Oh, god damn it. 
Okay, one thing that makes me mad is that I have the fusion monster that you can use to fuse Flare, w Flame, Wingman, and Sparkman. I just didn't throw it in the deck because I didn't think I would need it. But now I need it! That's not good. So I guess, can we, can anything happen? Yeah, nothing happens. Oh, wait! Oh, I'm so dumb! Oh, I'm so dumb! Because I think Skyscraper should work. Oh, wait. Target, uh, wait, 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 wait. Okay, so technically it wouldn't have mattered. But I, I forgot. Skyscraper's effect. Oh no, I choked. Oh no, I choked. I choked this duel. No. I choked this duel. It's not good. I I am gonna get Chaz. You are correct. You are absolutely correct. I'm about to get shit chazzed. No. No. No, 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 no. Oh no, I choked. I choked this duel. Oh no. Wait, that- wait, I think this is it! Wait, oh, Oversoul? Wait, I think we got it! Yo, Heart of the Cards! Yo, look at this epic victory royale. I don't think Chaz can do anything. I think we got this victory royale. Shout out to Skyscraper coming in clutch. Let's go, we won! Shout out to the top deck. Jaden's luck is coming through! Oh man, that was a top deck. Oh, Oversoul. Yeah, you can't defeat me. Yeah, you definitely got game, Chaz. Okay, that was intense. Okay, I thought we were going to lose that one completely after I did that horrible scenario of actions. But we top deck into the O Oversoul. Thank goodness. Thank goodness. Ha ha ha, it's over, slacker. I'll cook that wing Kribo and leave you defenseless. Secret weapon time. I sacrifice two cards and activate Transcendent Wings. Not me. You can't be. Transcendent Wings involves Spirit Wing Kribo to a level 10 monster. That's intense. Wing Kribo! Why don't you go ahead and deflect all the damage back to him? Lucky Punk, all my monsters are destroyed. We have a thousand light points apiece. All I need is the right monster and you'll be finished. You think you're gonna get that one that easily? Here goes something! Grr, I draw! Yeah, I summon Elemental Hero Avion Attack! Ah! Chaz got oofed. Chaz got big oof. That's game. Unless you want to duel again. Oh, we will. Impossible. Not with all the rare cards I gave Chaz. This simply can't be. Dude, get wrecked, bro. You garbage. You garbo. You got protective soul, whatever that is. I have never heard of that card before. Guess I'll have to go check that out. So that's neat. Hey, Cyrus. Oh, snap the tag duel thing. Cool. Cool. This looks nice, too. So, as always, with the end of these episodes, let's do some Cardo Lottery. I'm only going to do one of them, though, because I'd like to do them 300 coins a piece. So, maybe on next episode, we'll do two lotteries instead of one. But for this one, we're going to do one. And that's it. We got that Thunder. Thunder Giant Luck coming through. I don't know. And we got another copy of Protective Soul that. And we got another copy of Wing Kribo level 9. Maybe it was a sign that it should have built the Wing Kribo deck. That's cool, but yeah, apparently this is a new card. Cool, so we pulled that. I mean, what are some of the lottery stuff? So we have this new Neos card, which is interesting. What's in interesting about this, too, is that I don't know yet, but I w don't think... I don't think we would be able to summon Neos um, in this event, so it's kind of interesting that we got a Neos card, you know? But I gotta say, this Neos artwork looks so dope. That, like, actually looks clean as, like... Dude, looks clean AF. Uh, but yeah, I guess that's it for today's episode. I don't really know what else to say. Hope you guys enjoyed part two of the Dual Academy Let's Play. Please, please show your support if you're enjoying it by hitting that like button down below. And what if, if you want to get notified when I upload more episodes of this, be sure to just subscribe to the channel and all that good stuff. But yeah, I think it's going to do it for me, guys, though. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.